the first of the three sessions in the opening round of the Ladbrokes Irish Derby was run on Wednesday night. Six heats and all eyes really on number one Droopy's Jet in heat five and then in heat six the clash of Droopy's Kane and Camas Crash. And so to the opening heat of the 2012 Labrooks Irish Derby. And the first heat dominated by three greyhounds in the betting. Trap three, Paradise Martini. Big chances if he produces best form. Trap five, Lolo's Joe, a dog with plenty of speed from start to finish. And six, Tara Monica, a very powerful lady, very well drawn out in six. And there's the bell. The runners for the opening heat of the Labrooks Derby. One, Fairway Fusion. Two, Laherne Dancer. Three is Paradise Martini. In four, Minefield. Five, Lolo's Joe. And six, Tyre Monica. The Derby's underway. A flying start by Trap Six. Tyre Monica leads in a turn from in second spot. Trap Five in the middle. Or Lolo's Joe now two. Laherne Dancer squeezing his way through. Bad bumping at the start. And Trap Four and Five both knocked over. But out front. And it is Trap Two. Laherne Dancer leads down to the third bend from six. Tyre Monica. One fairway fusion draws closer on the inside and third. Onto the final bend. It's two. Laherne Dancer. Six. Tyre Monica now arrives at a rush. One fairway fusion back in third. But six. Tyre Monica goes on to win. The open Opening heat of the Labrooks.com Irish Derby, very close for second between two Learn Dancer and one Fairway Fusion, the winning time 30 12. And the result of the opening heat of the 2012 Labrooks Irish Greyhound Derby. First was Trap 6 Tyra Monica, second was Trap 2 Learn Dancer, while Trap 1 Fairway Fusion was back in third, the winning time 30 12. In heat two of the Labrook Starby, the betting suggested that six Camus was the one to beat. He looked perfectly drawn in the stripes of his rivals. One Danmar Benny, a dog with plenty of pace throughout, and the ECC Timber 550 winner was also entitled to respect, as was trap two, Ava's Fantasy. This fellow, another one with plenty of pace from the start. And so the runners in traps for heat two of the Labrooks Irish Greyhound Derby. In one, Danmar Benny. Two is Ava's Fantasy. Three, Deanside Bray. Four is Listen to Kill Jack. In five, Slick Seattle. And out in six, we have Camus there. Up behind traps. And away they go in a fast start by trap four. Listen to Kill Jack. Took a flyer from boxes. Leads to the bend. Up the inside, one. Danmar Benny in the outside. Six, Camus. Out front now in one. Danmar Benny strikes the front from six, Camus. Now in full stride. Then comes four. Listen to Kill Jack. Two Avis Fantasy, but six Camus on the outside of one. Danmar Benny around the third bend. It's still Danmar Benny, but six. Camus now just showing in front, but steering his normal middle to wide path. One Danmar Benny plucky in the inside. Six Camus on the near side. And Camus comes through to win. Second is one Danmar Benny. Back in third was five Slick Seattle, who flew home the winning time 29 86. And the result of heat two of the Labrooks Irish Greyhound Derby. First was Trap Six Camus in second, one Danmar Benny, and back in third, five Slick Seattle. The winning time, a very useful 29 86. Next up, we look at a very open heat where Sawdust Terry came into Trap Five as a reserve, and a dog not without a chance either. The favourite, though, three tired Justin, a star puppy last year, but yet to recover that form this season, and six Jimmy Boy, sure to run a big race here for Graham Holland. And in one is Krelko, two Lolo's Hope, three tired Justin, four Jamar Vixen, five is Sawdust Terry, and six Jimmy Boy. Away to go, three is out past tired Justin, leading up. In the middle, from six on the outside, Jimmy Boy. One, Krelko on the inside going well. But as Tar Justin leads into the back, going into second now is Jimmy Boy. Runs on strongly. Then one, Krelko in third, but racing down the far side. And it's Tar Justin with Jimmy Boy just in behind now on the third bend, trying to go through on the inside. And it's still Tar Justin in front, being challenged by Jimmy Boy. Then comes Krelko and making ground is Sodos Terry. But as Tar Justin kicks on again, and here's Sodos Terry. It's very close to the line between three Tar Justin and five Sodos Terry. And close for third between one Krelko and four Jamara Vixen. The time is 30 14. A thrilling finish to the third heat. The winner there, number three, Tar Justin, trained by Connor Fahey. Second was five, Sawdust Terry, and third, number one, Krelko, the time 30-14. Heat four saw Robbie's gone again, running from trap five, trying to recoup the losses incurred the previous weekend. 
a dog with good early pace on his night. Big danger here was two on Tucker Master, trained by Larry Mason, and a dog really running well at the moment. Reserve coming into one, climb a tree, doesn't know how to run a big race, replacing Lady Blackpool. 8-4 of the Derby. In one, we have Climb a Tree, two is on Tucker Master, three, Bulls Bolt, four, Rush We Record, five, Robbie's Gone Again, and six, Tyre Thomas. Away, and it's pretty level, one is out well, that's Climb a Tree on the inside, five, Robbie's Gone Again, going up second. Bulls Bolton on Tucker Master next as the race into the back and it's Climate Tree the leader by just over a length from Robbie's Gone Again in second. Tara Thomas and then on Tucker Master racing to the third bend and Climate Tree the reserve out by two lengths at this stage. Tara Thomas moving well on the outside into second. Gone past Robbie's Gone Again making ground Bulls Bolt but off the final bend and it's out front and going on to win this one. Number one Climate Tree for Larry Dunn. Five, Robbie's gone again, stays on for second. Close enough for third. The time is 30-22. Something of a surprise there in heat four with number one, Climate Tree, winning it for Larry Dunn. Second was five, Robbie's gone again. And in third, number six, Tara Thomas, time 30-22. Heat 5 saw one of the hot favourites of the night, Droopy's Jet, one of the outright favourites to win the derby, going from trap one, perfectly housed. The dangers here appeared to be two ruthless men, trained by John McGee, and in three, the young dog, Alan Master, with a big record. Here on its way now, four Heat 5, and in one is Droopy's Jet, two ruthless man, three Alan Master, four Razzle Dazzle Amy, five Kokoro, and six Sheepwalk Shaw, the hot favourite in one. <laughs> And away they go and he's away well. It's Droopy's Jet on the inside with Alan Master next and on the outside. Sheep walk Shaw but into the bend and Droopy's Jet has gone clear. Two of them have hit the deck. Four and five. Razzle Dazzle Amy and Kokoro. And down the back it's one Droopy's Jet out by five lengths from Alan Master in second. Then comes Ruthless Man in third ahead of Sheep walk Shaw. Around the third bend and Droopy's Jet galloping on out front. This is going to be a good run folks. Droopy's Jet off the final bend. Races up the straight. Wins very easily indeed from three Alan Master. Third is two, Ruthless Man, and then comes six, Sheep Walk Show, in a brilliant run tonight of 29.52. Well, that run from Droopy's Jet really woke up the derby, winning there in 29.52 by seven lengths from Alan Master, with Ruthless Man back in third. A terrific tussle anticipated here between in trap four Droopy's Cane, this brilliant John Linham trained dog, not the best away, likes the inside, and in one Camas Crash, a dog that really burst to the forefront with a 28-15 run here recently. The one to Preston, maybe the early pace Tina's Nova going from three. In one here we have Camas Crash, in two Rock Bursain, three Tina's Nova, four Droopy's Cane, five Tom's Brett, and six is Beanie Jones. Away they go, and it's Drubby's Kane well away, so is one Camus Crash, but it's five Thomas Brett leads up the outside. Thomas Brett leads into the bend, but Camus Crash rails well and takes it up, and Drubby's Kane is at the rear as they head down the back, with Camus Crash out front, two Rock Saint challenging in second, then comes five Thomas Brett. Drubby's Kane is absolutely flying, moves into fourth place, but around the last bend, and Camus Crash has gone clear, and has opened up a six-length lead now, turning for home. It's Camus Crash, impressed last week, He's more impressive tonight, winning easily. Drooby's Kane comes from the back to finish second. It's close for third in another brilliant run of 29.56. Another brilliant performance in Heat 6 with Camas Crash and Trap 1 winning for Rachel Wheeler in 29.56. Drooby's Kane coming home fast for second with Tina's Nova in third.